Hello, my name is Andrew and I'm doing the Pong game. So I have done um, my Pong game through like Arduino and then the coding and stuff. But I realized that the um, coding aspect could be a little bit more difficult. So there was an easier option I chose and I chose to do Scratch and I transferred all the coding that I had, knowledge and stuff, into Scratch and I, from all these codings right here, so this is the left paddle, so whenever you press W and S, it will move within the paddle same thing for the right one but this is up and arrow up down uh, up and down arrow so it works for the other ones and then the ball function since if it touches the paddle then it could um obviously like um bounce off the thing and de depending on what trajectories and i made the pop sound just because i think it's kind of, having sound effects would be kind of nice in this pong game and that's what i did that's why i wanted to transfer all my knowledge that i have into scratch so, just because it's a lot easier to set up and i did that with the ball function here and even the score system i have it on the top right you can see right there uh, with the balls and the, with the single ball and it's hitting with the paddles and stuff with the goals and it will score correctly to what um to each side so if right score then right will score and then left will definitely score and I can show you by playing it right now right here so it's it's right here and then here this ding let me ding over there and that's right score bounce right here you hear that too you hear the bouncing right there Alright, and that's all I did for my first milestone, thank, thank you.